Okay, cool. So we're going to take a look at this challenge, uh, famous fonts formats. Famous fonts, that's very hard to say fast. So anyway, uh, we want to make, we've got some famous quotes and we've got some declarations and we want to add a CSS rule that makes all the quotes have an italic font style. Okay, cool. So here we can see that we've put, uh, we've done the class as the quote and to edit a class quote, you've got dot quote as he's got done here. So we need to write in what we want to change in this CSS, in the style headings. So I'm going to say, let's change the font to italic. Now, it says, since you're only changing one aspect of the font, it's better to use the specific font. Key. Okay, fair enough. So I'm going to say, let's change the font style to italic. Over here, you can see the famous quotes has changed to italics. It's pretty cool. Okay, so that means you no longer need to use the um, open bracket I, close bracket dash I. You can just use this whenever you have a quote. Um, okay, cool. Declaration, what's it want then? It says, uh, okay, next step. Uh, add a CSS rule that makes all of the declarations have a bold font weight. So I'm gonna go in the declaration, I'm gonna say font, and I'm gonna say bold. And again, it's giving me the same one. If you're only changing one aspect of it, you should be more specific. So I'm gonna say font style bold. Nope, to make them bold, you'll need to use font weight. Okay, I didn't know that. So I'm gonna go do Okay, cool. Look now, my quotes are all in italics. My weights are all weighted. I'm Batman. Also, the new Batman movie coming out looks amazing.